people who might be interested in the synergy system or have a synergy system or uh, you watch my channel for reasons that I don't understand you um, if you have a synergy system and you're interested in new modules well that uh, that's the videos I'm doing right now um, so we have the BB the BEBB module different video the brilliant savage module different video and the equally brilliant uh, OS, which is uh, apparently an overdrive special, uh, which is a dumbbell. I can't say that. Synergy can't say that, but that's pretty much what it is. And I'm not going to go into what a dumbbell is because I don't really know. Alexander Dumbbell made a couple of amps and they're ridiculously expensive and apparently they have a kind of unique tonal characteristic. They're very thick, beautiful for single notes, just very, the word is thick. And um, the parody is completely insane. 
so there's a couple of companies doing Dumble clones. Uh, one of the most famous ones, of course, are Turok, all Dumbly amps, and then Serietone does some. And there are uh, Fuchs. You know, those are all Dumbly amps. Now you can get the Dumble tone in a Synergy, either in the Syn 1, Syn 2, uh, Syn 30, or the Syn 50. This is the Syn 50. Watch my video on it if you want to know everything about it. But the most important thing is this module. Now, I did not read the manual because... I, I want to ex I want to experience the sounds and tell you what I hear instead of what I'm supposed to hear. So I don't quite fully understand it, but we look at it. Hank, let's look at it. Thank you. So there's a I'm going to call it the clean channel, okay, with the volume, which I'm going to call gain, but that's kind of what that is, volume. And then there's a master for the whole module. Usually there's a different master for each channel. There's a blue channel and a red channel, but in this case, there's a master for the whole module, but I actually not. <sighs> so there's a... Why are you going to me? Thank you. There's a three-band EQ, which is shared, I think? <laughs> uh, presents. Uh, not like Christmas, but the other. And then there's uh, three switchies, which are bright, well that's self-explanatory, deep, which adds bass, and jazz and rock, which really changes the whole shebang quite a bit. And then there's overdrive level, which you would think is the level, but it's not. It's gain. And then overdrive ratio, which you would think is, I don't know what you would think, but that's kind of level. So, at least that's how I experienced the module. Let's see if I'm correct about these assumptions. It's going into the Synergy 212 cab, mic with a Lewitt MTP 440, and we're also hearing it, hearing it with a cream back loaded 412 out of the aux. And this is what it sounds like with all the switches off. With this um, Vola, but we're also going to go uh, with a uh, hollow body by Dangelico. So here. <laughs> Always want the bright in. It's a very thick sound, it's put some reverb on it. when you engage the deep. Let's see how that works as a pedal platform by throwing the ecstasy on the screen and um, we're well, kicking it in on the low mode. There we go. Thank you, Hank. Very thick, and it might be even too thick right now. But wait, we're still in the jazz mode. See what happens in the rock mode? 
<laughs> Blooms up. Throw that away. Um, that's a beautiful pedal platform. Let's go without the deep. Tuning options. With the deep. More, more like... Uh. Deep with upright. In jazz. It's just, that's just, that's just here. Nothing here. Um. Very, very nice. Of course, I've got a reverb in the effects loop of the amp. It's a beautiful, beautiful sound. Um, gets interesting when we go to channel two, because there's a lot of gain hidden in Le Double, which here is called overdrive level. <laughs> Because overdrive ratio is clearly a level. I'm confused. So you can see that the overdrive level, or the gain in this case, is quite low, but we also already have quite a bit of gain. See what jazz does. It does affect the drive channel as well, somehow. It does make it tamer. Thank you. 
I love that. So here's what's possible. <laughs> That's just great. Let's look at the, the... It's gonna be like a metal module, the heck no. You can rock with it, there's no question about that. But for me, it would be the lead. You can rock, but think it's a much better idea to get something like the BE module for that, which sounds like that. Because the dumbbell is all about roundness and softness. So, um... That's beautiful, but let's change guitars. Here we have a very different beast, the Angelico SS, all completely hollow, the full hollow body. Some reverb on this puppy. Well, let's go to jazz. Only bass. The bass boost and no brightness.
Very beautiful. So let's see what we can do here with this guitar with the overdrive channel. Folks, I just can't stop because that's lead tone heaven. Holy shit. That's that's neat. I mean, let's get a spring here. A little bit more. As I said before, that's as good as amps will ever get. So let's do the last thing, which is quickly look at the built-in DI out. So that's what that sounds like, going straight XLR into the audio interface. So for me, it's the OS module and the BEBB, -E never remember that. Um, those two together f cover a myriad of sounds in this amp. Obviously, any other modules, you just, you know, take out, put back in, get to go, totally different amp. So 
I think all three new modules, the Savage, the BEBB, and the OS, freaking nail it. it. I wish I had this amp, like I had like six or eight different slots in there because actually I don't because then I wouldn't have that big amp rack behind me, which is kind of fun to have. So um, you heard it. What else can I say? I just can't stop playing it. Thanks, Hank, for switching. I'm going to put links below to the modules and everything you need to know about Synergy. And uh, animals at the end. Bye-bye. <laughs>